What's up guys? Uh, I got a sling review for you today. I got the Rad Sling by ODG USA. USA made product uh, by my buddy Brian Bishop. Uh, Lone Element 2.0 on Instagram. This is called the Rad Sling. Rapid Adjusting Deployment. This sling is actually pretty cool. It has a lot of features and a lot of functional features, not just stupid shit that people don't need. Um, first things first, the uh, slider here. So this they call the stay, S-T-A. So what this does is this basically is your tension adjustment. It is very smooth. This is one of the smoothest ones I've ever used. Most of them are pretty tight. Uh, a lot of them are just a string or a strap that you pull. This one is very similar to a, a mainstream brand. However, in my opinion, this is much better. I own one of those mainstream brand ones that have this type of feature on there or this style. However, the reason I like this one better is one, the texturing. The texturing on this edge is very aggressive. It's not too sharp that it's gonna cut you, but it's aggressive enough that your hand is not gonna slip. I don't care how sweaty it is, if it's covered in grease, whatever, it's not gonna slip. The other thing is, it's smooth. Um, my guess is that's because of the, um, the, the strap material on this. Uh, also probably part of the design. So, but it is very smooth, very quick. Some of the other ones, you gotta give them a little bit more than um, you like, and sometimes it's hard to stop it right where you need it to go. Uh, thirdly, and maybe the most important is the weight on this. This thing is light. This little feature on the mainstream brand is actually kind of heavy, which is kind of ridiculous. Um, some slings are ridiculously heavy. Um, and that other mainstream brand does make some heavy slings, even though they're good slings. This is super light. So that's a big win on their part. They were definitely thinking, you can tell that they've carried too much weight in the field before. Um, Next, this uh, shoulder pad is removable. A lot of times they're not. That's a great feature because some people like these pads, some people don't. I don't like pads usually. Um, they're not comfortable and they rub. This one is actually real comfortable. I haven't had an issue with this yet. Um, it's still a new sling, but it's right now it's staying on. So I really like that. The next feature is for you long range guys, they have this little loop here that imagine I have a carabiner here and I'm trying to take a long range shot from a barricade. Now I can carabiner this to my waist to give me more tension and a much more stable shot for when I'm taking a really long range shot. That's awesome. I've actually never seen that in a sling before. So I don't know if that's new or if that is just ignorance from my part. Um, the next thing is people are always coming up with the new best way to maintain their sling and stow it so this has a built-in stowing system but i cannot tie myself up here basically what you do is you fold this in half and you get this part right here this buckle i don't actually know what this buckle is called but you fold it in half it buckles on top of itself like this and i'm doing a bad job of demonstrating there you go do it like that and then you cinch it up with the the slider and now I have a sling that is folded up stays exactly where it's at doesn't fall off and now I can stow this in a bag I can stow this in a vehicle I can sew it up against my wall against my my gun rack and I don't have slings hanging all over the place I still have full function of the firearm if I need it I pull it forward and back and it's out and then I'm ready to go. So uh, it does not come with the QD mounts to be expected, no big deal. It does have these keepers on it, these elastic keepers, and it does have a couple Velcro ones as well, which I have kind of stowed underneath here. Uh, it's 90 bucks on their website. They're in stock. They got cool colors. This is Ranger Green. They have multicam, black multicam, and I think it's Coyote or FDE. I'm not sure what the brown is, but whatever that is, looks pretty cool. Whatever fits your kit. It's gonna be awesome. Pretty sure it's Barry compliant. Um, usually his stuff is all USA made, so I believe that fits the Barry compliancy law, which I know nothing about. But go get them, odgusa.co, not .com.
Shoot straight.